Kenneth made fresh frozen orange juice brings you Gaylord Hauser, renowned author of the bestseller Look Younger, Live Longer, the book on diet and health that has swept the world. And now here he is, Mr. Gaylord Hauser. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Today I'm going to talk about faith and food. We all know that in the last few years, science has made some wonderful discoveries relating our state of mind with our state of health. When we are happy, you know, we are contented. When we have a feeling of accomplishment, a purpose, it is then that we are the healthiest. Your doctor agrees, and everybody agrees, that our mental well-being and our physical well-being are locked closely together. One of the great doctors of all time, Dr. Carl Jung. He's the man who lives in Switzerland, outside of Zurich. Thousands of people came to him from everywhere. This is what he said, that he noticed that people who had a faith, a hope, something an, of an interest higher than themselves, that those people became well the quickest. And I know this to be true personally because I believe I wouldn't be here today if I hadn't found my purpose in my life years ago in the city of Chicago where I was so very, very sick. Now, then, you will find that the opposite is also true. You cannot be cynical. You cannot be a gossip. You cannot be doubting and scheming and expect to be, remain healthy and be radiant. If your spirit and your mind is ill, your body will suffer. Do you know the most unfortunate people I believe that I know are the people who have no faith and no purpose in life. And so many of them, and you know them too, they show signs of unhappiness and unhealth. Now, of course I know that good nutrition can help you to find yourself. Not just diet, bread, meat, potatoes. But I mean in the sense of Ralph Waldo Emerson, America's great philosopher, when he said, every time you are pleased, you are nourished. May I turn that saying around? And let us see what comes out. When you nourish yourself rightly, you are pleased. In other words, if you eat well, if you eat healthful foods, you put your body and your mind in a condition to receive understanding and faith. It works in two ways, you see. Your mental attitude is reflected in your physical well-being. But also, when your body is relaxed, keen, awake, your mind is stimulated to greater deeds and greater faith. In a few moments, I'm going to introduce to you my friend, Jessica Dragonette. She's a splendidly balanced person. She's well nourished physically, mentally, emotionally. And I want her to tell you some of her secrets and what has helped her to become America's Princess of Song. But before that, some more good health news of tremendous importance to your well-being. Jay Owen will tell you about Minute Maid Fresh Frozen Orange Juice. Thank you, Mr. Hauser. Friends, if you'll give up all the mess and drudgery of squeezing your own orange juice and serve Minute Maid Fresh Frozen Orange Juice the year round, you'll be giving your family more vitamins and minerals, including more precious vitamin C. Now, look what that means to your youngsters. Yes, and to the grown-ups in your family. Vitamin C is absolutely necessary for strong bones and teeth, energy production, healthy tissues, strong muscles, vitality, healthy glands. Yes, and Minute Maid is not only better for your health, it has the wonderful flavor of oranges right off the tree. All the delicious goodness sealed in. No sugar added, none needed. And it's cheaper than oranges by the dozen. So, here's to your good health. To your better health with Minute Maid. Golly, that's good. Try some, won't you? And now I want you to meet my friend Jessica Dragonette, the singbird, the songbird, who comes here today as an author. Jessica, how are you? Delighted to see you. Thank nice. you so much, you Gaylord Hauser. It's a great pleasure to be here with you today. Wonderful. Shall we sit down, Jessica? Yes, let's. Right here. Thank you. I must sit rather close to you. Yes, good. So that's nice. Jessica, you come to me not as a songbird today, but as an author of a wonderful book called Faith 
It's a song. How nice of you to say so. I'm glad that you've enjoyed it. I loved it. I couldn't put it down. Can they get it all over the USA now, Jessica? I think so. It's in, available in all the bookshops. Oh, and published it is published by David McKay. McKay, yes. fine. All right, Jessica, what should we talk first? Well, first of all, Gaylord, I want to uh, say how sorry I am that I spoil your illusions of the singer. You uh, expected me to be tall and vast and, and uh, heavy, but I want to tell you that all the singing birds are small. Well, I have a secret, Jessica. I'm glad you're small. Thank I'm glad you, you very were tall much. and six foot. What should we talk about next, Jessica? The well, book, of course. We'll talk about the book, but yes. if you've read the book, you know that I have uh, spoken about being a student of Gaylord Hauser right. and uh, how the singing is half a sport and half an art. And the, the singer must treat her body like an athlete does. So I eat the things that they eat at the training table. For instance? Well, the basic simple foods. Uh, basic simple foods are the great uh, stabilizers and the great energizers. Splendid. Good pupil. Oh, an excellent pupil. That means lean meats. That means lean meats like beef, and like liver. liver. Did I tell you lots chops. of liver because you're so small? But lots of uh, green vegetables, vegetables and carrots for that nice shiny coat that it and gives for your the pretty horses. Hair. For hair and for the shine your in the skin. eyes and the aura around the notes, you see. I, I, I collect a pearly scale, so uh -huh. that's very important too. The leafy green vegetables uh, assure that. Splendid. Jessica, uh, what about when women let themselves go? You know, so many people get fat and unattractive and sometimes they're young, they're under 50 and they're still all out of shape. What do you say to that? Oh, I feel very sad about that because uh, women really should uh, beautify their world and the world in general. And I don't like to think of women being anything but purposeful and beautiful right. and decorative. Right, right. Uh, we all depend upon women for inspiration. And that brings me back to my the title of my book, Gaylord, yes. Faith is a Song. Beautiful I title. think faith is necessary. Uh, it is the substance of dreams. And unless we have uh, dreams and faith, Nothing happens. And lots of work. You only materialize your yes. dreams by having faith. And faith opens the door to everything. Splendid. Jessica, I want to ask you a secret. We all know you sing beautifully. But do you sing in the bathtub? I sing everywhere. Every, <laughs> every moment that I'm in awake. In the bathtub too? Away you from my music, question. Uh, I feel sad. Yes, everybody sings. A song is natural Certainly. to everyone. It isn't natural to write, but I think it is natural to sing. Jessica, does food affect your singing? Definitely. I if just you eat badly, what happens? <laughs> I try not to eat badly because I, know you I don't. have such a busy schedule that I feel that I am breaking faith with my audience if I cannot appear or I sing uh, badly. So that food is very important to tone up the voice is the same as toning up the muscles of the body because Certainly. a singer's body is her instrument. Exactly. Like you play upon a piano or upon a violin, mm -hmm. your own body is mm -hmm. your instrument. So if you want wonderful tone, nice ringing notes in your scale, you must have the, the foods that do that. And those are the, the leafy green vegetables, the lean meats and orange juice. Exactly. Jessica, we're going to make a drink in a moment, but before we do that, uh, in your book, The Thing That I Like, where you and I are a little bit the same, I, you're a pioneer, you're a pioneer in radio. That chapter to me was fascinating. I want everybody to read that. Then I am a pioneer, or was a pioneer, in teaching. You want to sing beautifully, and I want to teach people to be beautiful and healthy uh, in eating, by eating good foods. Oh, you see? Of course. I, I always feel about food uh, like I feel about my friends. So we're both Certain pioneers. foods are, are really like friends to me and they're right. going to do something right. wonderful for me. And you know in a concert I don't take any food only in the 10 minute intermission. Yes. So the drink that you taught me how to make you is... You still make it? One Make it now, energizing. Jessica. Let's see. Can you make it real quickly as you make it between intermissions? Take off well, the pretty gloves. Well, I take off the pretty gloves? Take off the pretty gloves. You can't cook in gloves, my dear, you know. <laughs> and into this, Jessica puts an egg yolk for nourishment. She puts in a tablespoon of honey for energy, and above all, it's made with our beautiful, beautiful golden Minute made orange juice. And it's a wonderful, nourishing something. Come on, Jessica. It goes immediately. Uh, can can you make a close-up uh, so they can into see Into the body. 
And one in eight. ten minutes, I have energy for the second half of the concert, Five. which is about... Put in this here, one spoon of your honey, and I'll put in the orange juice. You see, we have to be rather quick cooks here uh, in our well, you have housekeeping only. apartment. All right, like this. Now, Jessica, you stir it, mix it, Definitely. taste it, and tell the world how it tastes. You can't imagine how much energy you can get from this drink. And because Gaylord Hauser taught me how to make it, I never take it without saying, here's Hauser, he taught me how. Cheerio, cheerio, good for you. Jessica, you were a darling to come. I want everybody to read your book. I'll talk about it again. And I'm going to make a drink in a minute now. You were wonderful to come. And I hope I see you after and often and come on my program anytime. Incidentally, you should be on television. I'm going to see to that you are. Goodbye, <laughs> my dear. Thank you so much. Goodbye. Thank now, you. I would like to tell you one little thing about orange juice, <coughs> which I didn't tell you the other day. For reducing, Dr. Jolliffe of the Bureau of Nutrition in New York discovered that when you drink, all you waistline watchers, when you drink a glass of orange juice 30 to 60 minutes before you eat, it stops that craving and prevents overeating and helps to keep you slim and pretty and trim. Remember, you waistline watches 30 minutes to 60 minutes before. That's wonderful. Instead of pickling yourself with funny things, we eat beautiful things. Uh, enjoying good health becomes an extra pleasure when you hear what a certain charming young lady has to say on the subject. Yes, it's Miss Minute Maid herself. It's wonderful news for you and me That Minute Maid gives more vitamin C So why squeeze orange juice yourself? When doctors say Minute Maid orange juice is better for your health Yes, Minute Maid orange juice is better for your health Fresh frozen Minute Maid Better than the same oranges I squeeze at home? How could that be true? It's true, all right Minute Maid buys only special oranges blends and freezes the juice in a special way. Result is, year-round, Minute Maid gives you more of these precious vitamins and minerals. Vitamin C, vitamin B, manganese, potassium, and food iodine, which all adds up to healthier teeth, sturdier bones, better growth, rich red blood, and more vitality. Only of Minute Maid has this been proved true. Yes, Minute Maid orange juice is better for your health. You know, Jessica Dragonette embodies all the good qualities I can think of. Good health, good looks, and a happy mental attitude and faith. I want you to read her book, for you will learn how Jessica made a success of every phase of her life as an artist, as a singer, as the wife of a good-looking husband, Mr. Nicholas Turner, and now in her new career as an authoress. As I said, she's a good example. And until we meet again, I want to drink to you with this cocktail. And I say to you, to your good health, to your good looks, and to happy, happy living. Now, in the future, perhaps some of you will tell me what I should talk about. I look forward to meeting you again. Goodbye. <laughs> Minute Maid Fresh Frozen Orange Juice has presented the Gaylord Hauser Program. The preceding program, originally telecast by ABC in New York, has come to you by special video recording. This is ABC, the American Broadcasting Company.